course, they've just locked some poor English football coach up for 25 years for a bit of CBD oil. And this place is advertising itself as a tourist destination for Brits and Americans and Europeans. And we're all legalising CBD oil. I mean, my father suffers from Parkinson's. I know that CBD oil alleviates his suffering. And it does of thousands, millions of other people around the world with various ailments, um, MS, etc. CBD oil has got a lot of health benefits and it, even if you don't want to legalise it in your country, where do you come up with 25 years for a poor 25 year old lad who just happened to come over on holiday and got a couple of bottles in his apartment? Um, she's hardly Pablo Escobar. I mean, it's a ridiculous draconian sentence from a legal system which is well and truly broken. And people ask why 25 years. I'll tell you why Dubai likes to give people long jail sentences. Because Alawea is a billion dollar a year money making machine. Read Dubai, A Tale of Two Cities, my book. It's got all the numbers. It tells you just how much money they make out of Alawea. They like to keep that place full and they like to drain the resources of anyone they catch in their spider's web. <laughs>